very funny actor and comedian. His one-man show, Yeah, Yeah, is at the Neptune Theatre in Seattle, Washington, on June the 28th, 20, uh, 28th. 28th. Yeah, that's the new way of saying 28th. It's like LOL instead of uh, Lovely Wilm. Yeah, Wilm, yeah. <laughs> Please welcome Dylan Moran, everybody. I was just, I was just saying, that I was, we were just saying there. I said you want to do shaking hands, and then we did awkward cuddle when you I came out. I just went with, with what you seemed to need. Well, then I said, what about kissing? Do you want to do kissing? And you were like, well, uh, I don't know. There's a line. There is a line. There is a line. Well, we just met. Yeah. And I, don't, I, I just, I want to. Do you still want to kiss? I don't know. I'll tell you in a bit. I want to rustle your hair. Let's have a starter. At least. A starter? Yeah. All right, then. What do you have as a starter? I always favour a uh, prawn cocktail. <laughs> I don't know, but uh, I don't want... The thing is now, you know, you go to the places and they're too fancy, there's too much stuff, so they bring out, you know, a bee's womb <laughs> filled with cheese or something like that, and it's just... That's delicious, though. That's that too much. A bee's womb filled with cheese? I don't know if bees... I think only one of the... Bees, as, I don't even know if they have a womb. Only one they, of them would have a womb yeah, in the relationship. And the other bees have... Um, <laughs> how, penises? How, Do bees have penises, I think? Bee oh, penis, you can bee say it. <laughs> say it. I, I, all right, that bee penis. There, I said it. You happy? How dare you talk to me like this? I won an award. Didn't you see my pipe? It's a very small award. It is. But I won it. Yeah, it's all yours. So what are you doing your show in the Neptune Theatre for? Well, money? <laughs> there's money involved. Okay. I don't good. see the money. There's money there. There's money around. People pass around money. I just, I just do it. And so it's a front for a money laundering it's a, operation. They're mov it's moving money from one end of the room to the other, yeah. <laughs> I like it. And also because it's, I enjoy it. Yes. I can imagine you. There is that. Do you remember that? Do you remember when you used to enjoy oh, things? Oh, back in the day. <laughs> Now it's only the awards to fill my empty. That's all you have. Yeah. <laughs> smaller and smaller awards every year. They get I shrinking know. nano well, awards. Well, it's the, it's the iPods that do it. Yeah, everything is scaling down. Hence bee penis and so on. <laughs> have you ever been stung by a bee? No, I've never been stung by a bee. Because I just leave the room. <laughs> Like if a bee was to come in and angrily buzz around, it's, you'd be like, I, I'm, I gotta go. You change location. I'm not gonna hurt the bee. I'm not gonna attack the bee for being a bee. Would you put a dome over it, maybe? Uh, <laughs> no, I wait for somebody else who's stronger and less fearful to come along to dome the bee. What about other uh, creatures like that? Don't do that. Oh, I see. <laughs> That's the thing. Don't stop that. <laughs> no. You can make other movements, I, not those movements. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. You can, you can make... Don't do that. And then, and then do that on top of that. Insect movements are not widely popular. They are with insects. Insects do them all the time. They do them all the time. I don't like the way this is going. Okay. Fair enough. You ever read any Stephen King? I haven't. I haven't. I mean, I'm sure it's terrific. It's, some of it's very, very good, actually. I mean, really good. But why would you sit down to read, which is, you know, it's, it's recreation. Why right. would you sit down to read to be afraid? Because, it, <laughs> ah, now I've thought about this, because it's safe afraid. It's not like there's an actual bee in the room. It's just the story of a bee. <laughs> So it's like the bee came over and he wiggled his little fingers, but there's no one actually, I won't do the movement because I know it upsets you, but <laughs> you just read about it and you go, and so you can experience the adrenaline and the rush without the actual danger. So it's, what, he has a bee book or is he doing a bee book? <laughs> I wouldn't worry about it, Dylan. I think it'll be, and if he does write a bee book, you don't have to read it. No, I don't. Right. A thousand pages about a bee, I'm not going to read that. <laughs> Are you? No, I'm not, I'm not going to read it either. I, I, 
I don't think he's written it. The though. thing about fear is it's frightening. Terrifying. <laughs> Sometimes. Yeah, you know, and it's not even useful. It is useful. If no, it's useful if the bee or the shark or the tiger or the all of them. A bee and a shark and a tiger walk into a bar. Working as a team. <laughs> if they're all together and they have some sort of thing going on and they're all way over there, you know, and they're coming, then fear is useful. But not if they're as close as we are. They're but then it's too late. They're working as a team? The bee, the shark and the tiger? <laughs> There's something going on. And then they're there. And you're there. And if you're afraid, you think, I'm going to get stung, bitten, and what was the other one? B shark, B tiger. shark bitten, bitten twice. And ripped. Get bitten twice. Claws. Yes, I'm going to get bitten twice and stung. They're going to bite me, bite me again, and then sting me where the bites were. Yeah. Fear is no use to you then, because you're just going to be bloody and stung and throbbing and afraid. Well, you, I think we've all learned something. Are you a little bit more afraid of bees now? A bee on a shark. A bee riding on a shark. <laughs> across the waves, coming toward you. Making a shark beeline towards you. <laughs> It'd be about... dangerous though, because bees don't do well in water. This shark is prepared to... Help. Surface. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh, there you are then. So, Washington. Yes, I know. And all that. It's just as well, it's so clear we don't need to talk about it. Gosh, I, I wish we had more time. I know, me too. But there you go. No, I just mean in life, you know. Oh, no, I know. That's what I meant as well. Yeah. And after. Life. Like more, more, more afterlife? No, just more life, afterlife. But then, you know. Don't get into all that. People no, get I, know, upset. I know, I know. People in the those parts of the country. People in all parts of the country, all they, part, get that's true. they get very upset if you start messing around with their belief system, that's or bees, or sharks. Any of us. Or tigers. They could be in the room. They are. Oh, I saw one. A bee? No, one of those people under the desk. <laughs> He's gone now. Where did they... You're making that up? I did. To frighten me. To frighten me, to so use to fear to gain power over me. That's why fear is useful. What is the other possible use of fear? Is there any? Uh, no. No. <laughs> this has been a PBS special announcement. <laughs> Say goodnight, Dylan. Thank you. Bye-bye.